an hour. Alright guys, we're here picking up the trailer. We had to bring it back to the shop because I had ended up having axle issues with it. Uh, the front brake, or the front axle I should say. This side had a bad spindle or something, the tire was wobbling real bad. And, damn son, get it. And the back axle, the brakes were sticking real bad. And it just had a heap of problems with it, so they put all new brake axles on it and everything and warranty of course so all right get her chained up for me there you go yeah make sure they're looped crossed let me get it here i'm gonna hook it for you all right just cross them that way they don't drag. There you go. All right, put the pin through the hitch there. See the pin dangling? No, 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 no. Right here. See? Where you put it? Right through that little hole right there. There you go. Got it? Yeah, it's good. Here, 
Pick up the lights. You know I do that. There you go. Push in there hard. There you go. Is it latched? Okay. Here you got to put the pin right here on this one. See it? So the jack don't fall down. Watch your fingers. Okay. All right. Let's get loaded up. We'll see you all in a little bit. later all right guys we're back at the house finally it's been like four hours i'd do a bunch of errands but i wanted to go over details about the trailer a little bit more because i don't think i've ever i don't think i've ever mentioned it so it is a 16 plus 2 with a two foot dovetail um they had a little bit different design here uh, but i like this one the best it was heavier actually um had them add these behind the steps just in case something ever flipped up behind him. They couldn't like bend the fenders all the crap. Uh, spare tire. Had them mounted over there. Looks kind of grandpa-ish. But it's out of my way. And I ain't got to mess with it. So this is a load and go trailer. It is built in Omaha, Arkansas. As you can tell. Um, awesome place. You know, the guy's really easy to deal with they'll build anything you want basically um let's see the ramps are on this side i just i like them better over here just so you don't drag them when you go through like ditches but yeah we had this is the tire that had brake issues like literally it would get when you touched it the rim itself it would like melt your hand off so i knew that wasn't right took it back no questions asked swapped everything out and it's good to go i checked it several times on the way home and it's good it doesn't get hot up there and that tire does not wobble anymore i guess the spindle may have been bad but they threw all new axles leaf springs hardware etc on it so it's good to go probably won't tell anything now but it's good to go you guys like the journey i know it was a lot of um uh, a lot of time lapse really because it was like five hours worth of driving but i totally forgot to tell you the axle rating it's a 3500 pound uh axle so 7,000 pound gross is what it's capable um i've only hauled one truck on it so far but it handled it like a dream i really only bought the trailers to haul the pulling tractors so for that it works perfectly but yep nothing fancy it's a trailer if you like the video subscribe thumbs up comment down below if you enjoyed the video and i'll catch you on the next one see you guys